subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest updates. On the 9th of June the 15th, at the Galwan Valley area, at the China-India border, Indian troops um, uh, um, again crossed the line of actual control for illegal activities and deliberately launched um, provocations and attacks, which led to fierce physical confrontations and resulted in casualties. The sovereignty of the Galvan Valley area has always belonged to China. The Indian border troops flip-flopped and seriously violated our um, bilateral protocols on border-related issues and the consensus of our commander-level talks, which uh, severely undermined our military-to-military -military relations and the feelings of our two peoples. We ask India to strictly discipline its frontline troops, stop all infringing and provocation, provocative activity at once and work with China and come back to the right track of resolving the differences through dialogue and talks. And regarding the specifics, the two size border troops are now jointly dealing with the relevant matters on the ground. Matters in the Galvan Valley area, we have, we are having communication through diplomatic and military channels, and the right and wrong of this is very clear. This incident happened at the Chinese side of the line of actual control, and China is not to blame for this. After this incident, China and India have both said that we are committed to resolving differences through dialogue and safeguarding peace and tranquility in the border area. As the world's two biggest developing countries and emerging economies, the shared interests of China and India are far larger than the differences. Both sides should earnestly follow the important consensus reached by the leaders of the two countries and ensure that the bilateral relationship can move forward in the right direction that serves our, uh, our people's interests and expectations. We hope India can work with China uh, to this end. From the Chinese side, we do not wish to see more clashes.